Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Welcome to my workshop. I am so excited to do this video because I have been waiting a long time to do this. So over the course of the last year and a half, I've been getting stickers from you all. Other guys that have workshops, even girls, have workshops and um, have YouTube channels have sent me stickers and I have a stack of them. You know, I've wanted to do this for a while, like I already said, but I've been hesitant because I didn't want to do one or two stickers. So I have a good bit here. So we're going to jump right into this. Um, but once again, thank you for 2000 subscribers. The whole point of this video is because I reached 2000 subscribers. I had a little bit of a delay. I had some technical issues with my computer. That's all been resolved. We're back up and running, obviously, because you're watching this video. But we're going to go ahead and jump right into this. So first off, we've got Rob's Workshop. All right, there you go. All the links to these channels are going to be in the description below. So please feel free to go and subscribe to these people and tell them that you you heard of them because of me, being a craftsman. So we got Rob's Workshop. He is from the Netherlands. He does some really cool stuff. He's right now in the middle of remodeling his kitchen. It's kind of what I'm doing behind the scenes I don't I'm not recording it it's kind of something me and my wife are doing together and I don't like to videotape everything I do I think it's very important to draw the line between workshop videos and stuff you do with your wife um, so I'm doing that with her but it's kind of cool to see what he's doing and I'm doing obviously a workshop remodel so let's go ahead and add him to the sticker board yeah. There he is. Next up in this list is Desert Bum Woodworking. I really like this logo, it looks really cool. Now he does a lot of practical things. Uh, he's made some things for uh, babies, uh, like a baby uh, cradle. He's made a crib. He's done some really cool things, so go check him out. Once again, links are in the description below. All right. As a bum, you're going right there. Next up is your trash and my treasure. He does some cool stuff. He kind of uh, he recycles and repurposes a lot of different things. So uh, you might see a coat hanger, which he made into a sticker board. It's a really cool video. Um, and you might see a familiar sticker in that video as well. <laughs> Anyways, so um, go check him out. He's really, really cool. So we're adding him to the board. Uh, he kind of fell into place there. Next up, my boy TG. Or, sorry, T, my bleh. okay. Next up, my boy TJ's woodworking shop. Now he, uh, right now he's in a phase of collecting a lot of tools, and he seems to really find some tremendous deals through Craigslist and Facebook. So uh, it's really cool to watch, see what he does with some of his tools that he gets. Right now he doesn't have a workshop. I know that he's longing for that and he has a passion to want to get his workshop, but he's not there yet. Uh, I think he's uh, in an apartment. So some, th that's a little hard to do, but um, he's really cool. He's always watching my videos. So thank you TJ for watching those videos. Um, and please be sure to go check him out, subscribe, watch his videos, comment, share, like, everything. Shout it from the rooftop. Put you right there, TJ. Next up, NASA. Oh, wait a minute. That's from my other day job. Bob Lee's Woodworking Shop. Well, wood shop, sorry. Uh, he's really cool. I Actually, he's been following me for a while. And uh, I happened to be watching the Jimmy Dresta video. And I'm like, hey, I know who that guy is. And then he said Bob Lee. I'm like, oh, my goodness, this is cool. I know Bob Lee a little bit uh, through just YouTube, really. Um, but he does some really cool shop stuff. He, he does a lot of uh, practical things as well. He makes. He just made a TV stand. He just finished it. Um, he's kind of in the same boat as a lot of other woodworkers are. Uh, me, uh, even Shane's hobby shop, which we'll talk about later. Uh, it's just uh, you know the summertime hits and a lot of other things demand your time and attention. So the workshop it's a little bit put aside. Um, of course, when fall and winter hit, everything gets rolling more. But he does some really cool practical stuff. So go check him out and tell him B and O Craftsman sent you. You tell you, I really like some of these stickers. That's a nice vinyl sticker. Next up, Buzzsaw. All right, 
Now that's spelled with an H at the end. This is a little different. This guy is not a woodworker. Uh, and in fact, he made a video about getting my sticker saying the same thing that, hey, this guy is a woodworker, which his channel has nothing to do with it. Obviously, it is about um, rescue. And so he's got some really cool videos on that. He's got some cool videos on some uh, guns and ammunition, different things like that. So hey, he's a really cool guy. Uh, uh, pretty down to earth kind of guy too. So add him to the board as well. Next up, as I've already said before, Shane's Hobby Shop. And I'm going to go ahead and throw his wife, uh, Know What Mom Knows, into it. Um, he posts a lot of woodworking uh, crafts and uh, I wouldn't say crafts, good grief, uh, Shane. Forgive me for saying it's not crafts, okay? Um, he does a lot of pallet wood projects. He takes a lot of pallet woods. In fact, I just you know saw recently on... Uh, his Facebook, Instagram feed, he got a, a big load of pallets and he was dissembling. So, I mean, really cool stuff. Uh, you know, some people shy away from working on pallets because there's a lot to deal with. you got a lot of knots, you got a lot of nails. None of them are ever straight. Um, but if you're into making country stuff or you're trying to make things that are going to be outside, pallet wood is perfect for that. And it's free most of the time. Some stores got onto it and realized that they could start charging for pallets. Um... Try to stay away from those guys. Shane's Hobby Shop. Go check them out. Link's in the description. Alright, he's going to go over here. And then we're going to add Shelly up next to him. I'll put him, put her next to him. And they're side to side. All right. Okay, so that's about it. We got all the stickers on the sticker board. And as I've said before, if you have a sticker and you're a creator, or if you just have a workshop, send me your sticker, I'll send you mine. I'm going to have my address in the description below, so you can just mail it to me, and I'll be sure to send mine as soon as possible. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I was really excited to do this. I'm going to be really excited to continue to do this. Now, Buzzsaw did, does a thing, he, does, he calls it mail call. I think that's what I'm going to start calling it. So when I get about two or three stickers, I'll make a mail call video. Really cool, really cool idea. I'm excited. I've got some more projects. I actually got a project that's kind of hidden under here on this workbench. If you haven't checked out the Tidy Workshop Remodel series, this workbench turned out awesome and I'm loving it. I've done a couple of projects already on it. Thing is solid. It's awesome. Really, really excited. So this other project I'm really excited about too, um, but it's kind of a secret project. So if you're uh, seeing this kind of hidden, in different videos that you're watching this it's been kind of in several places in my workshop um, you're gonna be really excited when you see it it's not gonna be my normal type of video not gonna be narrated a whole lot it's gonna be a lot of just watching so that's gonna be really fun I hope that you enjoyed this if you did give me a thumbs up share this thing big thing yeah you, know, you know I'm really being a lot more active on Facebook uh, so if you're kind of following me here got to go to Facebook and follow me if you've got Facebook because lots are happening there. Um, and please share these videos. Uh, share them on your Facebook. Share them on your Instagram. Um, and just share them on your YouTube. Um, you know, this is a great community. And I think the way we all grow stronger and become uh, closer is that we share each other's work. Uh, I try to do that. I try to subscribe to a lot of these guys, follow them, and comment on their videos. So, Long-winded, really. I was just really excited to do this video. I've been watching another guy here on YouTube that's really got me pumped up on uh, wanting to do more in my workshop. Uh, so I hope you can see. I'm really excited. So I hope you enjoyed this. I'll see you next time in the workshop. Thank you for watching.